Hello and welcome to WePC Benchmarks. My name is Seb and today I'm taking a look at the new Call of Duty game, Vanguard. The newest installment in the series takes place in World War II and we'll be benchmarking the game in multiplayer free for all and we'll be running the game at free resolutions and on ultra quality to see what kind of performance you can expect. Well, we start off with the RTX 3090 and at 1080p it averages 225 FPS for 1% of 165 and 0.1% of 134. Moving up, and at 1440p, it gives us an average of 149 FPS for 1% of 113 and 0.1% of 83. And then at 4K, we get an average of 93 FPS for 1% of 71 and 0.1% of 67. Next up is the RX 6900 XT, and at 1080p, it averages 240 FPS for 1% of 156 and 0.1% of 3. Then at 1440p, the card averages 170 FPS with 1% of 129 and 0.1% of 110. And then at 4K, it averages 97 FPS with 1% of 69 and 0.1% of 59. The next GPU is the RTX 3080. And at 1080p, it averages 209 FPS with a 1% of 141 and a 0.1% of 67. And then at 1440p, the card averages 151 FPS with a 1% of 117 and a 0.1% of 72. At 4K, it averages 98 FPS with a 1% of 67 and 0.1% of 64. Up next is the RTX 3070. And at 1080p, it averages 155 FPS with a 1% of 110 and a 0.1% of 93. Moving up to 40. 40p and it averages 103 fps with 1% of 74 and 0.1% of 55 and then at 4k it averages to 59 fps with 1% of 47 and 0.1% of 45 then is the rtx 3060 ti the card averages 139 fps at 1080p with a 1% of 105 and 0.1% of 98 then up to 4040p the card averages 90 fps with a 1% of 56 and 0.1% of 50 then at 4k it averages 51 fps with a 1% of 36 and 0.1% of 34 the rx 6600 is next and at 1080p the average is 104 fps with a 1% of 82 and 0.1% of 66 moving up to 4040p the card averages 73 fps with a 1% of 57 and 0.1% of 20 then at 4k the card averages 38 fps with a 1% of 27 and 0.1% of 25 up next is the RX 570, and at 1080p it averages 62 FPS with a 1% of 48 and 0.1% of 12. Moving up to 1440p, and it averages 42 FPS with a 1% of 30 and 0.1% of 27. And then at 4K, it averages 23 FPS with 1% of 15 and 0.1% of 11. And lastly, we have the GT 1030. And this one we could really only manage 1080p and so we looked at three main settings and we start off with the lowest and the card averages 52 fps for 1% of 35 and 0.1% of 32. Then on medium it averages 23 fps for 1% of 15 and 0.1% of 10 and then on ultra the card averages only 8 fps for 1% of 2 and 0.1% of 2 as well. So there you have it, Vanguard benchmarked with 8 GPUs. And it is not too difficult to run at 1080p, as you'd expect from a first person shooter that is competitive. These were at ultra, so turning down the settings can gain you the extra performance with ease. As seen with our 1030, which even on lowest it gets over 50 FPS, which is about 40 FPS more than it does on ultra. I hope you enjoyed the video, thanks for watching, please like and subscribe, and we'll see you in the next one. Video.